storm will impact most of the East Coast. A state of emergency has been declared in Tennessee, North Carolina, Virginia, Maryland, Pennsylvania, New Jersey, and Washington, D.C. Here's a live look at the White House, covered in snow, several inches already on the ground there. Snow plows are also out in Philadelphia. Mass transit will suspend service for 24 hours during the height of the storm. David Spunt from our sister station, KYW, joins us now live from Philadelphia with more on the conditions. Hey, Christine, beautiful night here in Philadelphia. We're on the top of the famous Rocky Steps at the Philadelphia Art Museum. The snow really has started to come down in the last two hours or so. Christine, we see about two inches on the ground right now. People are out here taking photos uh, up here with their dogs, really kind of enjoying themselves. The city has been under a state of emergency since 9 o'clock this evening. The Emergency Operations Center went into effect, so that's where things stand in Philadelphia right now. Uh, officials really don't want people. People on the roads. They're trying to clear them just as soon as possible, getting all those plows out on the main highways, on the local highways. Uh, so basically, things are expected uh, to get worse. We have two inches right now on the ground, but clearly that's going to continue. When folks are waking up in the morning, they are going to see a lot more. And in the distance, Christine, you can barely even see the Philadelphia skyline. So a lot of snow coming down here right now in Philadelphia on these steps of the Rocky Museum at the uh, Philadelphia Art Museum. You know, Reporting we were live tonight in Philadelphia. David Sp oh, I'm sorry, Christine. Well, no, and we were just wondering that here back in the studio in New York City, those steps looked familiar, and I was wondering if you were outside the, yeah. the art museum there. People have their four wheels we going down the, the steps. We are. I know they're doing four wheelers. They just started doing that. We haven't seen that before, so uh, something different. And that just happened probably about two minutes before we came on live. All right. Well, a little different from the Rocky scene, but that's all right. Thank you so much, David. Yeah. The storm will be in full swing tomorrow, and our coverage starts bright and early at 6 a.m. right here on CBS2.